Hello YouTubers, Joe Kersey here on uh, Tuesday, May 15th, 2018 at well, it's getting on towards 1700 in the afternoon Eastern Time and I got a package from C.M. Almy, A-M-A-L-M-Y the liturgical garment outfit here's the alb Here's the 12 foot cincture, also called a rope. And here is the carrying bag for it. And supposedly I've got a mono, you know, my initials on the others, you know, we're somewhere in there. We'll have to see. Let's try to put this bad boy on here. Uh, I hope this isn't going to be too long. I have a feeling I may have to take this up to get uh, altered. Yeah, I'm going to take this up to some outfit to get altered because it's uh, I need to take about two inches off the bottom of this thing. But let's check the uh, let's just check the. Uh, the chest and the neck here. Yeah, I'll find an alteration place. There's tons of them around here. At least so I'm told. Uh, they run up the uh, run up the uh, put this little snap up here in the neck somewhere. Yeah, we'll have this thing in time to go for Trinity Sunday here, probably. Then you tie this little thing here. Yeah, it's it's going to be way, well, it's going to be longer than what I want, because when I go up steps in these things, I don't want to fall down face first, or at all. Ass first, face first, sideways first, whatever first. There. there you go. All right. Now this is going to be fine because uh, usually I wear an undershirt under this wool shirt, and uh, and the rope. Well, the rope will be fine. Uh, actually, this is marginally usable, uh, but still, I you know better to be safe than sorry. So I think I'll have this thing shortened by uh, at least an inch and a half. Uh, possibly two inches, ideally. Um, yeah, no, this is the perfect size. Otherwise, the sleeves are the right length. Uh, the neck is certainly the right thing. But the chest is fine because I can, you know, in the winter I can wear heavier clothes underneath this. So, yeah, good show. Meanwhile, there's this garment bag. Good Lord, it's taller than I am. <laughs> it's got my initials on it. Yeah. Looking good, Kings Island. Oh, you can't see me. Yeah, well, I'll take this over to the alterations place. Well, As the weatheroids, the weatheroids predicted here this morning, we just had our fairly, uh, well, it was brief, but it was intense. Well, it wasn't that intense. Uh, rain shower, but there was a lot of thunder going on all over the place. And once again, the uh, strong stuff, actually the strong stuff this time went south of us. Uh, yesterday it went up north of us, so. Quite often the heat island effect from Columbus makes this stuff kind of deflect off one way or the other, but didn't seem to today. Wool shirts uh, in this kind of weather are uh, surprisingly cool if you have to wear a shirt. Uh, the Arabs are onto something. 
you know, those desert guys, you know, with all the flowing wool robes, you know. They're no fools. Do your old time machine back up. It's been a computer housekeeping sort of day today. Um, uh, my machine isn't hissing and fizzing as much as it was, but uh, I spent, gosh, I spent the better part of five or six hours uh, running viral, antivirus programs on this thing uh, until I finally got them all to come back clean. And uh, then I pulled a lot of uh, my movies, you know, my hard drive was getting, well, full for my hard drive is around with 230 gigabytes of available space because it really slows down and acts crazy otherwise. So I got that stuff out of there. Uh, but I didn't do that until I had run Disk Utility and repaired the disk, uh, which required me then to start it up from the recovery hard drive, uh, which meant I had to get the manual out, you know, the David Pogue Sierra manual out to find out how to do it again. Because I've done it before, but I always forget how to do it. Uh, so it seems to be running okay now. Uh, I haven't done a backup since April 22nd. Well, computer stuff, huh? So, uh, I'll horse around here and get this thing repaired. I don't read again until the last Sunday in May, so this should be plenty of time. I don't know, maybe I can Tom Sawyer Liz into doing it for me. I'll pay her to do it. I mean, she's offered to do stuff like that in the past. But we'll see. Anyway, that's it for today. So I'll say bye-bye, YouTubers.